Back in action, we back in the action, boys. Name Brown Thames. Wait, wait. Ca uh, the camera just died. Fuck! Uh, really? I'm just joking. I'm joking. I was not a joke. I thought I'd get that classic name brand fuck line right in the beginning, you know? Well, no shit. You're fine. Keep going. So today we got a special video. I was about to tell y'all why big, big special reason this video is special. One is because Karen Matt Adams back. He's already pissing me off though. If you guys don't know, we had a little falling out for the po like the past month now. And okay. I uh, finally got him back on the team. So leave a thumbs up down below if you enjoy this fuck being back on the channel. Of course, y'all know the name brand fans real strong. We're marking the game the greatest of all time. Y'all the goats. And you're a fuck. All right. So I've been getting this request a lot. And I've been, I think we've done three videos of this in the past. Going to 7-Eleven and filling something hype up with a slurpee. I didn't want to do the same thing as we usually do. One, because I'm really trying to get into the clothing crazy customs that I've been wanting to do for a little while. So today I thought, you know what? Instead of taking a sneak, instead of taking a seat, Instead of, fuck! Instead of taking a sneaker back to 7-Eleven as we usually do, why don't we take a Supreme Box logo hoodie, shit, shirt, and tie-dye the bitch using some Slurpee ingredients. Here y'all go if you want to legit check. The one reason why we're doing this is because I threw an egg at my wall in a recent video. If you guys didn't watch that, I lined it all over my fucking shirt. So I thought, you know what? Let's fucking tie-dye the bitch. If you guys want to do a legit check, here you go. There's a tag on the inside. This is my personal shirt. I wear quite a bit, but I said, fuck you boys, let's do a crazy video that might get us kicked out of 7-Eleven for the first time ever. Yeah, we've never been kicked out yet. We've never been kicked out. No. This one might be the one. Probably. Let's hope. Anyway, join us in the car as we go do some crazy stuff to get views on YouTube. Leave a thumbs up down below if you dig. You dig? You dig. Is that chill? Yeah, dude. <laughs> it's trill. All right, so Brandon made me come outside to start his car quick because he's too scared of getting cold. So I thought I'd uh, lock him out. Ready? Ready, ready, ready. That's going to be even more cold. Ah, locked you out, bud. Huh? It's cold. Barely. <laughs> it's unlocked. It's unlocked. <laughs> Don't do what the that. hell? You just have a kitchen knife in your pocket at all times? Yeah, I lost my fucking uh, pocket knife yesterday. People but you live in like such up. a nice neighborhood. Don't question it. Sh like, stop. Why? Okay. What Can do you, you use not it for? Lock me out anymore? What do you use it for? Is what I want to know. What do you use a pocket knife for? Whittling. Same thing as you're gonna. You didn't even start the Cutting car. Cutting small things. I might have forgotten. Don't be such a baby. Fuck you. Yeah. Alright boys, we're on our way to 7-Eleven right now. I'm really stoked for this one. I, I don't really like doing the Slurpee customs anymore because it's the same shit. But I think this one's going to be pushing the envelope, at least for the employees. And I think they're probably going to kick us out. And right now what I want is reactions from people. So you guys, you know, get a little bit of a laugh on a video. So if we can start to get kicked out or something, maybe I'll talk back. You never know. Because if I'm on camera, and I know it's going to get me views, I have a problem with getting a little mouthy. Yeah, you can't <laughs> stop yourself. Y'all let me know down below right now before we get in there if you guys think they're going to kick us out or not. I think I'll be very, very surprised and almost, I, I'll almost feel bad if they don't. No? Because there's going to be a mess in there. If they just okay. take it and they're just like, fine, yeah, okay, just get out, please. Yeah, like, exactly. We'll just, we'll then, then, I, then I might offer to clean up for them. Yeah. You never know. Anyway, we're marking the game, of course. Let's go to 7-Eleven. What are you doing? Nothing. Just filming. A little bit of transition. What? Transition. Oh, okay. You know, B-roll. <laughs> Do you need to start over there? No, I don't know. No, just keep going. Okay. Just keep going. Okay, whole fucking bitch almost hit me. That's good B-roll right there. Fuck. All right, boys, we're here. So you know what I was just thinking? What? We should probably stop going to our local 7-Eleven that I personally frequent quite often. <laughs> anyway, by the end of this little custom, you boys are gonna know how to make your own t-shirt a little tie-dye hype me style from 7-Eleven. Should we go? Let's go. Let the games begin. <laughs> First off, you want the important colors for the custom, which is gonna be the lighter ones in our eyes. You think? Probably the lighter ones. Yeah, a bit lighter. Maybe some purple and orange. Pink. Hold the shirt properly so we get a good thumbnail. Perfect. Alright, so you want to sluice it around. What we're gonna do is take each color and kind of layer it. You gotta point it to me if I'm talking. Because the well, fucking you're doing you're there. you're you're doing stuff. So we're gonna while try to talk. make colorful stripes on this shirt, just like this. Just like this. We're gonna go over to the. Bring it over to. The blue. Blue. Yeah. Perfect. Make sure you see that. Get some supreme logo in there, yeah. 
Oh, yeah. Like a, yeah, a little bit of a burrito yeah, in there. Flipper over. Hey, nice. <laughs> yes, boys. We're doing it big. Do 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 do. Side on my shirt. Do you have a mop or something? Yeah. I'll, I'll mop it. I'll mop it for you. Leave that there to dry for a second. Now we have a duty to do. They're nice enough to give us a mop. Guys, clean up after yourselves. Yes. Please. Hey, come on. <laughs> Don't. Do dude, doing? these are nice pants. <laughs> Why are you doing that? Awesome. All right, take our t-shirts. Well, don't you can't don't make a mess again. Well, now it's gonna be too slippery. Really? Mom, look at this. Mom, boys. <laughs> Show him your pants, buddy. <laughs> Yo, he peed himself. <laughs> he peed himself. He just pissed his pants. <laughs> Show them. Show them. He peed. Is it possible to make it a large? Use them on that one. I don't want to not pay for it. I don't know. You already peed yourself. Perfect. <laughs> Success. Now we're gonna go home and show you how to make it even better. <laughs> Adam decides to go back in and clean off his pants in the washroom. <laughs> fucking idiot. They don't even have a fucking washroom in there. <laughs> Piss pants! Piss pants! Alright boys, so the next step that I wanna tell you, while you're driving home, you got in a bag already, just like smush it up like this and tie it shut. What that's gonna do is I'm honestly not sure, I've just seen it in tie-dye videos. Squeeze like, the juices out so it can like sink into more areas. That's what you're gonna do with it. You're gonna do what he just said. I knew what to do, I just was testing it. Yeah? Yeah. No, you still remember the code? Duh. I have to tell my dad to change that. Why? He really, he do really doesn't like you having that. Whatever. I th we thought you'd forget it, I so we're just like, don't worry about it. Announce. Usually can't remember numbers or anything like that. <laughs> Moment of truth, it's time for the reveal. Now, I don't know if we have to do anything else to make this even doper. However, let's see it. Oh, oh, baby, don't, oh. don't put it on the counter, dude. What do you mean? It's gonna stain. It's gonna stain. Well, it's gonna it's leave gonna a big sti sticky mess. And you know what, this you know is you why, of course, we came to my house to fuck shit up, hey? Sticky messes, you know what you are right now? What? A big face full of monkey semen. You're a bitch. Stop. You come into my house, you make it sticky, and you insult me. Clean it up after. Get out. Absolutely, Are you're you expelled from my house. Or I'm expelled from your house. You're expelled. You fucking World of Warcraft bitch. What are we playing? PvP? Oh, expel him. Fuck hey, him. don't act like you didn't play more than I did. Yeah, when I was 12. Yeah, well, I was 10. Uh, did the new expansion pack. Fuck you. <laughs> you it's love the expansion packs, don't lie. You're the World of Warcraft ass. I'm like, can we just show the shirt? Yeah. Wow, here we go, boys. We just got the tie dye. Supreme. That looks box really, really good, shirt. actually, and it looks really good on camera too. It looks too. really good. Yeah. It looks, does it look good on camera? You bet your ass it looks good on camera. Oh my god. Right? Boys, we just created something genius. Now I know a lot of you guys might not want to do this to a Supreme box logo. I mean, not main brand. We don't give a fuck. A rat's ass. Nor a monkey's what? Dick. Dick. Nice. How did you know I was gonna say that? Snap. That was wild. <laughs> oh baby. <laughs> anyway, boys. That's it. You guys want to take a Hanes white shirt in? Do it. You guys want to take any other white shirt in? Do it. This is Supreme Box logo, making it a little bit more cool for y'all. This turned out amazing. I just wonder how it's wow. gonna wash out, if it'll stick in a little bit or what. Well, you, I don't know. Don't ask me that. Okay. I don't know. I don't know either. Now you're ruining it. People are like, oh, it'll just wash right up. Fuck you. I'm saying we should make a second video saying how to keep your tie dye. I don't know, man. If you guys want a rejuvenator video, we could try using rejuvenator for a shirt. Rejuvenator. Rejuvenator. Well, yeah. we can't just like dump their fucking brand. No, we'll start our own brand. Is we'll what I'm saying. Yes. We'll take rejuvenator bottles, put rejuvenator like tape it over to say shirt. Rejuvenator. Rejuvenator. Fuck them, right? Yeah. That's good. Okay. Anyway, boys, y'all let us know down below how this turned out. I don't think y'all thought it would turn out this dumb though. That was amazing. I think amazing. we can both guarantee it. Yeah, no, yeah. I, you can't guarantee it. Now, uh, we, we got a little other segment for y'all. Let's get back there. All right, boys, welcome back to a segment we haven't done together in a little while. A What's time. it called again, though? It's time for Chillin' with Dan Brown. Uh, 
Um, no, I just played the clip. You always do that. The clip already just rolled. Well, so if you guys don't know what this is, pretty much we try to get this vid video to 10 minutes without for more ad revenue. Fuck. The main thing is it's uncut, uncircumcised, so I don't so have to edit more. Stay in there. Yes, and also just to get 10 minutes so we can get more ad revenue and talk to y'all in the video. So if you guys watch this series, sometimes we just shit talk and like talk around yada yada, give a little topic. Mm -hmm. Today. I just asked you if you if you guys don't know Adam has quite a few sex stories and uh, Sometimes if we're lucky he'll share one on the channel now. I asked sometimes. you if you have one ready Yeah, we haven't done one for a while. Okay, I've done one kind of in the this might be pocket. only our third one He never does it's, this. Oh, uh, yeah, maybe third or fourth. I think. All right, let's go. What's your sex story, buddy? All Do right, I know it, this Purcell? happens. Yeah, you know it. Oh, yeah, okay. it's actually a well-known story between the two of us. Okay. Um, Wait, just give me a hint. No, just keep going. All right. Okay. So this happened in, I want to say, winter of 2016. Last thing, if you guys want to see more sex stories from Adam, maybe we'll act him out next time, whatever. Leave a thumbs up and a comment down below. <laughs> that would be a good side series. Right? A, new, a new YouTube channel. That would no be my YouTube channel. No shit. Just, All right, yeah, get on to your actions. story. You're, just, you're, you're wasting time. You're wasting time. Sorry, sorry. Winter 2016. Um, so I can't remember about? exactly where we were. Somewhere in Osborne, which I was, was like some... We were both out together. Okay. It was in Osborne. It okay. was, so if you guys don't obviously don't know, doesn't matter. It's just like some hipster kind of area. Got a lot of bars in it, and um, we went to this thing called Soul Night. And it's kind of like a more freakyish, like more hipster kind of okay. event. And uh, this kind of weird looking freaky chick, super hot in my opinion. But she was weird looking. Just like you can tell, she's a bit freaky. You know, okay. like gauged out ears and stuff. It's called judging a book by its cover. Oh yeah, you, yeah. and I... I do. Okay, all right. <laughs> So, <laughs> judging by where you're going, it probably came out you were correct on this statement, mm -hmm. on this accusation of yeah, bucks. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. All right. So, I don't know when you're going to chime in on, like, when you're going to pick up on what story yet. it is. I don't okay. know yet. Um, So, we got to dancing. We're all pretty bonesed, and uh, me and her ended up leaving, camped okay. to my house. What was her name? I you're honestly gonna keep a... can't remember. Okay. I honestly right. can't remember. Okay. All right. Um, and we're in the basement, because, of course, I live in my parents' house. So, they're all on the second floor, and we go down to the basement, and... Um, before we start actually getting to action, she starts talking about her her fetishes and stuff. It kind of it was. Ah, like, I, I remember this she's story. A, she's a bit freaky. Boy, is this a wild story? Yeah. Oh, okay, all right. Ah, I'm ready. And this is like. And I this didn't is the think first you'd be telling this one. It's a good one, I think. Okay. It, it deserves it. All right. And uh, it was being spanked, like okay. real hard. She said that she was super into it. But of course, like, mind like just spank, cause that's kind of normal. Like, are you, are you talking not, about not real like hard? slap spank? I'm talking about like with objects. Like oh, she wow. has a paddle at home. Okay. But of course, she didn't bring it on the town, you know. So, I'm at my house with not a lot of paddles laying around. Okay. And I run up to my garage, cause I'm instantly I'm like, well, if I have, if I can find something that resembles a you paddle, go with I'm the in. Flow. You right. Go with the flow. If this is what it takes, I'm I'll absolutely, absolutely do, you do it. Do whatever you need to for the poon. So I go into the garage and <laughs> hanging on the wall, and I swear to God. I remember this rays of light beaming off of it as it saved my. Let me my just ass say it. you're a piece of s h i t for I, this. It wasn't bad. It was my sister's His old sister. His sister. Her, her yeah, her old cross. Uh, they're called crosses actually, and uh, she used to play it <laughs> back in so the day. There's so many wrong and things. And it was just it was just hanging up there, and it's not like a big. You so know, not only crossing. was it your it sister's, young, but like, it was your little sister, like when she was young. Yeah, like yeah, when we were all pretty Disgusting. young. Disgusting. This is like you know a miniature size kind of cross. It's like maybe. Uh, yay big or something like okay. that, you know, and and I just saw that kind of circular piece at the end of it. I was like, that's paddle like, isn't it? I mean, it's made yeah. out of net, but sure, it, it it has to do at this point. Okay. I brought it downstairs and just her eyes lit up with hope, yeah. and 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 honestly glory. Which isn't even a paddle, like it's filled with like fucking. It's just net. It's, it's net weird. and just like with a kind of a plastic. There's a plastic. They're rain stainless kind of. steel, are they not? Or aluminum? The or something? the rod is absolutely Jesus stainless steel. Christ. Uh, okay. It's got to be durable and tough, you know. Yeah. But. Yeah, and and that definitely got her done. Uh, I was spanking her from behind so at one a point bit. were you when you were this spanking is... her were you were you having flashbacks of watching your little ten year old sister playing with Don't Lacrosse all that. happy? Don't were you having say flashbacks? That. This is a whole, a nice wholesome story. No, this isn't wholesome. I didn't have any flashbacks like that. It's like taking until, my sister's Barbie doll and until, like shoving it off hey, a girl's vagina. On. That's gross. It is That's gross. gross. That's what I'm trying to say. It's disgusting. And it wasn't like that at all until. She asked for a little swat on the face. Okay. And of course I was taken aback. <laughs> what I was end did absolutely you just... taken aback. <laughs> well, I mean, the rod is already in your ass, am I right? I'm just kidding. I'm, I'm just joking. I'm going to act this as you do it. So what end, of the, what end am I holding? You're holding the rod okay. with, the, with the tip, you know. All right, so, the, you, the so she, she asked you, so you like swing up like this? Like, I, you, or is it I was, just, what's your stance? Well, she asked for, she said, 
you slapped me and I said, how hard? Because I was taking, I didn't want to even slap him in the first place. But I mean, if, <laughs> I, if that's what well, it needs, then right, that's so what All right, so I got the needs. stats. That, that answered me. What was the stats? <laughs> It was baseball, very baseball like. Jesus, so you're very like, baseball -like. you're ready to I've never, swim. I've never done this before. I'm about to tell you, if a girl gives me a fucking, uh, what are those things? Cross. Like, uh, no, a thing that usually they slap butts oh, with. A, uh, a paddle. I can tell you right now, if she wants me to paddle her ass, I'm not swinging up like this regardless. I might do that no, I, had, I had knees but bent. But this is I had wild. knees bent, you know, ready to go. Of course I didn't go this full power. This is freaky, okay? We're running out of time. I, I, only, I, only, I hit slightly. I hit slightly. Unfortunately, I did knock her on her side. <laughs> <laughs> so did she have, like, it the was, grid marks in she, her face? The next morning. I mean, I didn't see her the next morning. I saw a snap story later the next day, and there was, yes, there so was Barton, netting, this, this netting was, pattern on the face. Here's my analogy. This bitch was pretty much looking like the alien grid monster. You ever see that? I've alien versus Predator? Alien grid monster, no. You know Alien, the movie? I know Alien, There's yes. one with, like, grid, grid all across his face. It probably looks very similar. So it was like, it was, Jesus. Yeah. Wow. She forgave me. She was mad? Well, she was take. she didn't expect it as, I mean, she said as hard as All you right, can. Alright, wrap it up. It's six she minutes, hard as hard as you can, Did you I, get laid? Yes. There was some intercourse before I knocked her on Bullshit. the Bullshit! Nate Brad fam, real strong. Mark in the game, the greatest of all time. Blah. Hey, baby.